All right, let's check out some baseball tonight, huh? Well, the Orioles beat the Royals 6-1. to one, And the Yankees beat the Rangers 1-0. Uh, while, uh, Nestor Cortez Jr. was flirting with a no-hitter today. But the Yankees still won one to nothing. Yeah. And the Yankees won their 20th game this year. And now they have the best record in the majors at the moment. Uh, Pirates beat the Dodgers 5-1, to one, ending their 16-game losing streak against the, the Dodgers. Dodgers are still 19-8. and eight. Uh, The Dodgers only had four hits tonight. Edwin Rios had a pinch hit homer, but that was pretty much it. But Mookie Betts extends his hitting streak to 10 games, and Julio Urias was our hard luck loser today. And the Pirates had 15 hits tonight. And Jose Quintana got the win. And, uh, yeah. And the Reds beat the Brewers 10-5. Yeah, they beat the Brewers 10 to five. And the Oakland A's ended their uh, nine game losing streak by shutting out the Tigers two nothing. Guardians beat the White Sox 12 to nine. The Angels beat the Rays uh, 11 to three. Angels are 20 and 11 right now. And um, congratulations to Shohei Otani hitting his first ever Grand Slam. And um, Mike Trout also went deep as well, had three RBIs. Shohei had five RBIs and two homers, and Jared Walsh had three RBIs, and Noah Syndergaard got the win. And the Phillies shut out the Mariners 9 nothing. Cubs shut out, shut out the Padres 6 to nothing. The Marlins beat the Diamondbacks, or Diamondbacks beat the Marlins 4-3. And the Giants beat the Rockies 8-5. Um, to five, And Chris Bryant is going to be out with back stiffness. So no uh, return for Chris Bryant to his old ballpark where he played part of the season last year. So yes, the Yankees have a three-game lead over the Rays. The Twins have a three-game lead over the Guardians. And yes, the Angels are ahead of the Astros by a full game. National League... The uh, Mets have a six-game lead over Atlanta. Um, the uh, Brewers have a two-game lead over St. Louis. And the Dodgers lead the Car Padres by a game and a half. So I'm sure we'll get our 20th win tomorrow with Tony Gonzalez pitching. And every team in our division has a winning record. And let's check out the NBA. Um, the Boston Celtics have even their series at two games apiece with a huge win in Milwaukee, outscoring the uh, Bucks by 15 points in the fourth quarter. 43 to 28 in the fourth quarter, meaning that Milwaukee had a uh, seven point lead going into the fourth. And both. And. Uh, and also, uh, Jason Tatum had 30 points and 13 rebounds. Al Horford had 30 points and 8 rebounds. Marcus Smart had 18 points and Jalen Brown had 18 points. Meanwhile, Giannis had 34 points and 18 rebounds and 5 assists. Brooke Lopez had 17 points and 7 rebounds. And Drew Holiday had 16 points and 7 rebounds. And Pat Cunnington had 11 points and... Boy, the Lakers, the the Bucks miss uh, the Bucks miss uh, Drew, Chris Middleton. And meanwhile, the Golden State Warriors take a commanding three games to one lead over the Memphis Grizzlies, outscoring the Grizzlies thirty nine to twenty nine in the fourth quarter. And yes, the uh, Grizzlies had a seven point lead at the end of three. So. Um, yeah, Dylan Brooks had 12 points. Jaron Jackson had 21. S Steve Adams had 10. 
points and 15 rebounds, but Kyle Anderson, 17, and playing without John Morant really hurt. Meanwhile, Steph Curry had 32 points and five rebounds. Draymond Green had 11 rebounds and two points. Andrew Wiggins had 17 points and 10 rebounds. And uh, Clay Thompson had 14 points, and so did Jordan Poole. Kevon Looney had eight points and nine rebounds. So yes. And Steve Kerr was out because of the protocols. So Mike Brown, who was already hired as coach of the Sacramento Kings, coached him to a victory. Warriors were a victory. And with the war and with the Kings missing the playoffs 16 years in a row, maybe he can lead the Kings back to the postseason. Hey, be thankful you're not a Sacramento Kings fan. It's kind of odd because um, uh, it's kind of odd because whenever the Warriors make the playoffs, the Lakers miss out, and when the Lakers are in the playoffs, the Warriors miss out. The exception was 2013 when Mark Jackson was coaching the Warriors and Mike D'Antoni coached the Lakers. However, the San Antonio Spurs beat the Warriors and the Lakers in the playoffs that year and um, went to the finals after sweeping Memphis. And then, however, the Spurs lost to the Heat that year in 2013. Meanwhile, that's all we have for you tonight. And I'll catch you all later. Uh, last but not least, uh, Let's check the, the, the NHL. Uh, today, uh, the Flames have tied the Stars at two wins apiece, and the Colorado Avalanche have swept the Nashville Predators today. The Pittsburgh Penguins take a 3-1 lead over the Rangers, and the Carolina Panthers tied the Capitals 2-2. But the Kings are back in action uh, tomorrow night uh, and as well. And we'll see if the Lightning can go for a three-peat as they play Toronto tomorrow. Meanwhile, have a great night. I'll catch you later. Uh, peace out.